Hi, thanks so much for joining me. So today is everything I got my daughter for Christmas. She's 10 years old and I'm gonna link everything in the description. I'm also gonna tell you guys where I found everything. So in case you uh, can find some things locally if you're interested. So yeah, so the first thing is this Klutz candy cart. It is this little miniature um, things that you can make out of clay. I love how it comes with like every single thing. And let's see, so yeah, I think it's really, it might be, it'll be probably really fun for her. I got her one of these kits last year, it was just like a different theme. Okay, so the next thing was this Pac-Man arcade game. I got this from Target. I thought it was really fun. I used to play this game when I was a kid. And I like how it just, it just requires like three AA batteries. So that would be pretty simple to just keep, you know, changing the batteries if um, we need to do that. And she's never played Pac-Man before, so I think she'll be really excited. Okay, next thing is something else kind of like a nostalgic that I played with when I was a kid. This is the original Clue. I found it's like the Retro Series 1986 edition from Hasbro. They have like different editions. They have like the newer one. But yeah, I thought it'd be fun to get this one. Like I remember those names. And I thought this would be cool for us to play together as a family. So I got her that. Okay, so the next group of items is like the only clothes I got her for Christmas. I pretty much, you know, buy her clothes seasonally. So she didn't really need a lot of clothes. But I'm going to show you guys. It's kind of like an outfit and pajamas. So this, I'm not going to open them just like to mess with the packaging. But this is the brand Leverett. And I got these on Amazon. I really like this brand. They're 100% cotton. And this is like size, I believe, 12. But yeah, so I'm just gonna, yeah, size 12. I'm gonna keep them in the packaging, but it's just like cute little uh, green and white striped pajamas. And I was like kind of on the fence. Should I give these to her on Christmas Eve or like wash them and give them to her so she could wear on Christmas Eve? Or should I just put them in um, her Christmas, um, you know, presents? I'm not sure yet, you guys, but like, but yeah, I got her these. Okay, so the next few items, it's like an outfit kind of. I got her from The Gap. And so the first thing I got her was this really cute beanie. That's the first thing I got her, this beanie. And then I got her, these are huge. They're still in the packaging, but they're so cute. It's these um, bear slippers. And, you know, she was actually looking at some similar to this when we went to, I don't remember if it was like Marshalls, but these are so cute. These are, yeah, it's like, I don't know if it says the size on here, but I um I, I forgot exactly what size they were. Oh yeah, three four. Okay, these are size three four slippers, and so yeah, so I thought these are really cute. So these kind of go with her pajamas, and then I got her a dress. This is um a Gap little tutu dress. Sorry, you probably won't be able to see the whole thing, but. Just like a cute little, the top is like a cotton scoop neck. It's size um, 12. My daughter is very tall. Pants is always, she needs 12. So they, they didn't have like, some brands have like 10, 12, but this, this one just has size 12. And so it's so cute. It's like a tutu dress. I got her this, not those, <laughs> one dress. And then I got her some leggings to go underneath it. So this is actually not from The Gap, but it's from the brand Mini Rodini. Um, if you watch my stocking video, you saw I got some socks from the same brand for her to put in her stocking. Okay, so that's her outfit. Okay, so the next thing I got her, hopefully you guys can see it pretty good on the camera. It's a pretty good size box. I mean, sorry, let me move this stuff over. It's a pretty good size box. It's this large toy brand, toy mini brands by the brand. It's like Zuru, Z-U-R-U. And it's like a little store. Yeah, so she's been collecting these little mini toy brands for a while. So I thought she'd really like this. Let me flip it, see if it shows. So yeah, so it, I don't, it says, I think it comes with like five of them. So I got her some extras. This shows how you put it together. So I got her like a bunch of extras to go with it. Because not only does she play with these with her like LOLs and her Barbies and things like that, but she also just likes to display them. So this, this would be fun. 
and you know she's getting like the older she gets i say that the smaller her toys get <laughs> i know this is a good size but the like so yeah so to go with this so to go with this set and this is from amazon and if you can see sorry i let me it's like yeah it also says like five exclusive minis inside and I think it comes like with a shopping cart too, which is really cute. So she can like set up the store how she wants. I thought that was so cute, you guys. Okay, so now to go with that, I got her a ball, which this one is like the food one. They have different ones. This is the foodie mini brands. I got all of these on, I believe on Amazon, unless, yeah, I think. Okay, series two foodie mini brands. So that one's a food one. I got her to go with that. And then I got her this. This is, I think, yeah, this one's from Amazon too. This was mini fashion. This one was really excited about. I thought she'd really like the fashion, like purses and different things. So it's two of them. And then I got her this little blind bag. Now this, I believe, was from Five Below. Five Below has a lot of really cute things. Um, so this one, this one doesn't say. It's just like the original, I guess, the mini shopping brands. It's not like a specific one like the food or the fashion so oh i think it's more the like foodish stuff but yeah i get gross minis um these reminded me you guys i don't know if you're familiar with when you're a kid well when i was a kid i grew up in the 80s so i grew up with garbage pail kids and we had like the garbage pail kids stickers and i still collect those and these kind of reminded me of like the 3d like plastic version of like garbage pail kids so like i don't know if she'll put this in the store but i thought it's really funny I'd be interested to see what they are. <laughs> so yeah, you know, it's like all these different weird, like this, I guess this is like spoiled milk. So and yeah, I don't know. Like you could, I could think of some imaginative play if you put like this in a store. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so that was a toy brand set. So one of the things she asked for this year was um, a few more LOLs. So I found this really cute kit. It's like the LOL mini sweet set. So the theme for this one was like Jelly Belly. I think some of them have like different themes inspired by like candy or like different cereals or different things. So yeah, so since this one was Jelly Belly and it comes with, looks like two, yeah, like two older sisters and then two little sister dolls. I thought they were really cute. So I got her this. And then to go with that just kind of as like a fun add-on, which you could say I could put this in her stocking, but I thought it'd be really cute to go with this. It's just like a Jelly Belly set of, um, you know, candy. So that was really cute. Okay, so one of, one of her, I'd say like, this is, this item's gonna be a total surprise, but yeah, I think she's gonna be really excited about this, but this is um, Nintendo Switch Luigi's Mansion. And so, I, th I don't know if that's Luigi's Mansion. Yeah, Luigi's Mansion 3. But so she just got a Switch last year. And she really doesn't have a lot of games. So we're slowly building up her collection. And so she really asked her what game. We asked her what game would she want. And this was like the top of her list. So we got her this. I know nothing about it. <laughs> and um, sorry if I didn't say, but the last item, the LOL was from Amazon. This, I believe my husband ordered it from Best Buy. But I know they have them on Amazon. And then... This, I believe, was from, like, World Market. Okay, so continuing. This is something I got just to... I think I'm just going to stand this up next to her presents. Like, I don't think I'm going to wrap it, but it's really cute. It's Mulan Rudy. It's a um, tree, like a tree house. Cute little animal coloring set. And my daughter wants to be an architect, so... Also, I have another video if you guys like books. And my whole channel is books. Mainly I do like what I'm reading. I do videos like what I'm reading, what my daughter's reading. I also homeschooler, but most of my videos are book related. I do a lot of thrift store shopping for books and things like I do holiday videos. So I'd love for you to subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And I did another video that is Christmas theme, where it's like my daughter's book advent. And you'll see a lot of other books like this. And then I also did her stocking. And then I also did like... Um, yeah, like another picture book Christmas video. So check those out if you're interested in books. But yeah, so this was really cute. And then it also comes with these really cool stickers. It's like, um, yeah, I don't want to ruin the packaging, but it's like plants and all these things you can use to like decorate your house. So I thought that was really, really cute. I love this brand. They have really cute things. Okay, 
So this is something that doesn't really present as much, but it's really cool. It is a blank set of, sorry, it is a, it's just like uh, to make stickers, like just white sticker page pages. So it's got like a 30 pack of eight and a half by 11. These from Amazon, I made a sample one. This is my daughter's name. I just made like just to test it to see how it's stuck and it sticks really good. I didn't color it or anything, but I just put it on here. So that's just a quick, I just did this in like, you know, real quick. But so, um, yeah, so it, it does work pretty well and I like it. So most people buy these for their printer, but we're not gonna use them for our printer. We're just gonna have her, she's just gonna be able to draw with them like with a Sharpie to make stickers, so yeah. Okay, now hopefully these don't come off as something too young, but she's like just now getting into these calico critters at 10 years old. And she, honestly, she really, really, really likes the furniture. She asked me, that was one thing on her Christmas list. She asked me to get her some like dollhouse furniture. And like last year or year before, maybe I bought her like a kit where it was just like this, like made out of wood. But anyway, so I found these two little kits. This is like Calico Critters. It's a table and chairs and then like a little, like a, another little a little piece. It's like a dining room set. I got this locally at a store called Learning Express Toys, but I'll definitely link them. But yeah, so that's the little furniture. And then I got her this also. It's like a tea and treat set. It's called uh, by Calico Critters. And it's like a green little table and chairs and so neither one of these came with the little critters so i went ahead and just got her a set of them because she's like really really obsessed with cats and this is really cute it's like a tuxedo cat family uh we have a cat now we have him we got him like a little bit less than two years ago so she's just like cat crazy so i thought they'd be really cute and um yeah so she's 10 like i said she still doesn't like plays with toys and stuff like that. And I think she'll really like them. So another thing that is aimed for like a younger age, but this was something she had when she was younger, but I think it got misplaced when we moved years ago. And she's been asking again for Hungry Hungry Hippos. So this is a Hungry Hungry Hippos game. Like it's just a classic. I had this when I was a kid, but like we had one like when she was like really young, but like I said, I don't, we don't know what happened to it. When we moved, some boxes got lost. So it could have been that, but yeah, so I replaced it for her. And she really loves this game. I really wanted to get my daughter some more building toys for her collection because she wants to be an architect and I accidentally purchased the wrong one. I thought I was buying just a plain Lego classics. I was not paying attention on Amazon. It's okay because there's still, there's still a lot of classic blocks, but this one is actually around the world, which some people might you know, want this one specifically for that, but it's okay. Like I, I didn't want to return it just for that. It comes with like a poster and like these little um, you know, like you can make animals, but that's, I really thought, like I said, I thought I was just buying like the Lego classic bricks and I don't know what happened, but this one, so this one does have extra stuff you can do, which isn't a bad thing necessarily, but yeah, so, um, <laughs> but we're just going with it. Uh, but yeah, so I wanted to get her some more Legos and to go with this, I got her a Lego city, uh, little road. So I'm not sure. Is it come? I think it comes with two. I guess. Uh, yeah, I think this is what it is. It's like a road. So she already has. She has a, a quite. A, no, she has like two, two to four of these road plates. And so I wanted to get her some more of the road plates. So she's getting this set. Okay, you guys. So the other thing I wanted to get her to add on to her construction collection is magnet tiles. Now I will say she has been playing with magnet tiles pretty much consistently for like five years. So she's 10 and she's been playing with magnet tiles since she was about like five. And we just keep adding on to her collection. And this is Picasso tiles brand magnetic building tiles. I got the 100 piece set. Yeah, so she really, really loves building houses with these. So these will definitely help her uh, build larger buildings and things like that. So yeah, so this is um, one of the last things I got her. Now, I will say that I'm getting her one more thing, um, which is like, we just we just watched the Barbie movie and she 
got inspired and she says like oh i want another barbie and so i was kind of like thinking i might get her a barbie for her birthday too but yeah so that's one other thing i think i'm gonna go ahead and get her was maybe like a barbie thanks so much you guys for watching especially if you got this far thank you to everyone who subscribes and supports my channel and i'd love for you to do so if you haven't already if you enjoyed this video have a good holiday